do we have a store back there where we could actually try not yet um you you just kind of have a lot of basic supplies back there um back at the town you guys haven't so, really uh the rusty swords and stuff like that let's mm -hmm. just put it at the armory right is yeah, that what sure. 200 gold was no no uh the, the, you just had uh there was like 40 or so rusty swords um probably couldn't carry all of them back i did, you guys don't have a bag of holding yet do you can't remember no. if you've no, yeah no. haven't given you one yet um that was other campaign that was other campaign that you got one gotcha so uh, that kind of stuff i if it's a rusty sword it's better than no sword especially for a brand new place right so i'd say let's put them in the armory if anything we could use it as scrap maybe sure yeah i mean or our villagers at least have some bite if their lives are on the line all right um so uh you feel the ground fell and it's warm you look around and you see an oddly placed mountain uh about a quarter mile to the it's more of a hill it's odd sloped to the northeast and fickles pointing over to the north though and she's right this way and you you're looking at it and all of you it just looks like a odd formation that's covered by moss and grass and and the like as you approach uh fickle approaches this little hole that's about eight inches in diameter and she's like okay guys now shrink down what <laughs> I, I, th I, I thought you were guys were real powerful. <laughs> <laughs> Not that uh, kind of power. Where would you get this idea? I, I, well, I don't know about you, but the others have done a little bit of research on, and, and I thought you guys are powerful, like the hags, and battle like a dragon thing and i don't you know and none you, of those things involve being five inches tall well i thought you guys just had powers so uh, do you have any other way in because obviously uh we can't really help out with that uh, well i <laughs> let me check and she's flying all around and uh let make a perception pray. check everyone oh goody perception check uh, no advantage. Nice. Alright, green. Perfect. The, you've, you're just like, something seems odd about this formation. And you're looking at it and something clicks in your brain. This is just a formation. It's not a natural formation at all. This is part of a huge, humongous statue of some sort it's a huge humongous gigantic thing <laughs> yeah it's just been covered in hundreds and hundreds of years of natural processes so the dirt accumulates and then the grass comes and forms over it burying it and uh at that time that you come to the realization fickle finally comes out there's a giant hole up there hey nice it's a giant hole. Yeah, uh, I can get up there just fine. How about you guys? <laughs> uh, you guys got rope, away on, right? You yeah. guys, you yeah, guys we got can. rope. I'll go up there. I'll go up there with the rope. I levitate. You know, because we got fucking rope, Rambo. All right. Well, in that case, let me. I levitate I... and uh, scale the side of whatever the formation is with the rope behind me. Oh no, no. that's not what I want. Um. One second, Zach. Sex and druids. No problem. Um, da -ba -da -ba -do. Did I put you on this one? The right one? Zach, can you see uh, the... Uh... Yeah. I can see. Whoa. Right. Are we going 3D here? What's going on? No, oh, sorry. All sorry. right. Sorry. And uh, down to at the bottom is uh, what you see. Oh, okay. And, so I should uh, work you off can... the bottom? <laughs> the no, no. I mean... Uh, you, I mean, right down here, I'll move the image right down there. Uh-oh. Uh, can you just whisper me real quick and tell me what I'm seeing? Because I'm going to look All right, what you see, uh, did I move the map down there for you? 
Yeah, I can see it. Yeah, okay. I see, so I see, uh, that's like the top the... down view. Okay. Okay. And yep. I'm sorry it's shitty. I created this about an hour and a half. Okay. So no, it's pretty me. cool, actually. Uh, <laughs> I, I like the, the 3D one. Yeah. Actually that, that, that's going to be your the overall uh, thing, right? But the top down view of this top floor is what you see. Um, the, some of the, on the left side, you see this um, intrusion Overgrowth. of the outside world. Uh, coming in here and forming this grassy mound right there. And you see dust yeah. all around. I need you to make a perception check. Is Which way am I dragging the rope? Are they going to come up on the slick surface or up the grass? I'm, I'm... You're about over here. Okay. Uh, actually, yeah, no, uh, you're, if you're coming from where they were, you're coming over here at the stone. And whispered to you. Okay. Um, yeah. You don't really notice anything um, too crazy uh, going on so, here. Is that a big hole? Because I will say I'm having flashbacks. That is a so big I'm, fucking hole. So I have no intentions of jumping down there right well, now? Well, that, that uh, hole, you see, you can you kind of levitate over there. And you're, yeah. you see uh, that th there's this floor. Right, and there's this hole in the middle of the floor, and you can see all the way down. It looks to be about a hundred and uh, 40, 40, 80, 60. It looks to be about a hundred and uh, a, no, shit, 140 feet. Is that 40? 140 feet down to the bottom, all the way to the bottom of those. But uh, is this like a, a pyramid sense where, like, if I get past this hole, is it like a, a chamber all the way down? Or it, it looks like, like a, a chamber, thing? it looks like. There's some mechanism that you see, and you actually see some odd engravings along in the circle um, that the base that you're hovering over. You look towards the walls that are quite high. The, these walls are about 40 feet high. Um, Fuck. That, and hey, you just see these... Do I know... Hmm? Does the language, uh, the symbols, and there's stuff like that, no, I... there's no language yeah. to the symbols. They're just mystical carvings in the okay. in the rock themselves. Um, so I'll let you describe all that to the players of what you see, and I'll unwhisper you. Sure. All right. Uh, so I'll float kind of back down to the the group and kind of talk to them real quick. Um, all right, guys. I've only. I can only control this for so long, uh, so we kind of have to move pretty fast for me to be able, be able to help us out here. I'm seeing like a giant hole at the top of this uh, formation here, this statue, this hill. It's It looks like grass to us down here, but it's very much stone up there. And I'm seeing like these mystical carvings. It's not a language I recognize. And there's a giant, like kind of a pit, like a rectangular hole. And so I really think that we should all get up there. So grab this rope. I'll take the other end and I'll float up and then um, I'll use a pitten and kind of mount it here into this ground. All right. So they can climb up. Yep. So they and, and climb on the ground, not the stone because it's slippery. Yeah. Are, are you are you going down in there? I'm not going into the hole. No, I'd like to get them up here with me um, because then we could pit in a rope and we could all. Yeah, I'm saying you're there. not the hole itself, but you, you're going in the onto the floor area, <laughs> this floor. Um, yeah, I'll have to touch it to put the pit in yeah, there, yeah. but I won't really... My hands have touched it to, like, pull myself up across the wall or whatever, but... Mm -hmm. Yeah. Alright, yeah. uh, how much? How long does your levitate last? Ten minutes. Alright. Oh, good. It's been... <laughs> and I mean, it's been a good five. It's been at least half of that. Um, okay. By the time okay. you go up there, you look, you go back down, and then you go back up. It's, yep. it's maybe pushing around six or seven minutes now. Uh, you just hammered the pitten. And, uh, guys, the rope is taut. And I need Zach to roll initiative. Oh. Um, oh, okay. uh, uh, you missed it earlier on that perception check. Uh, yeah. But all of a sudden you see I this. I missed something. Yeah, this. You're looking as you're hammering the pitten in. There's layers of dirt here that have been disturbed. Okay. Like, just removed, straight up removed. Like, a, you don't know what a vacuum cleaner is, but I'll use that reference. Uh, like, a vacuum cleaner is just kind of 
sucked everything up and it looks to be about um, 15 feet by 15 feet uh, and you turn around and you see a little <laughs> gelatinous cube God uh, damn it. right next to you oh, fuck. <laughs> a classic Fucking gelatinous Classic cubes <clears throat> I know oh wait, uh, where did you go yeah that was kind of weird oh so, you're wait, underneath you don't stick your dick in that. hold on I don't know what happened here <laughs> Because I need my logo to, to roll. Yeah, the I know, I know you do. Sorry, that was Never. weird. And I'll it, get some battle music going on. Um, damn, that was sucky roll. Huh? Uh, I really like my gear. I don't want it to eat my gear. <laughs> yeah. Fucking cubes. <coughs> Fuck. You were about like right here, hammering it in. And uh, luckily, it, it hasn't attacked you yet. It doesn't quite surprise you because you hear it slinking around. But uh, uh, GM will really info. There we go. I don't know if gelatinous cubes have a the concept. <laughs> they have an intelligence of one. They don't really really surprise. They have blind sight, which you know. Um, oh, I remember. I remember my last run in with them. <laughs> yeah. I, I'm just glad I didn't uh, swan dive into the hole this time. Yeah. So HP, that one. come on, work. Yeah, this time you did swan dive into one. That, this that's is going to become a thing for you. It's just gelatinous cubes everywhere you look. All the ruins. It. It's the second ruins you guys have discovered, and it's the second time you guys have discovered gelatinous cubes. But uh, the <laughs> rope is taut down at the bottom. Uh, who's first? You, um. Like jumping he's, up, yeah, um, you start. As soon as I know there's a problem, I'm gonna. Oh, no, you up. don't. No one knows there's a problem. You, he's no, several no, hundred yeah. feet away. Who would go first then? You guys would honestly be very casual. Uh, is my assumption? Yeah. I swung down. And I was you like, got Yo, you guys. Things are cool. Well, I mean, the the only reason I can see a rush was he was in a rush throwing it to us, and that we don't want to remain that ten minutes long. thing. Yeah, that's, yeah. yeah. I mean, he well, quickly, he, but not like. Yeah, you guys don't. Yeah, I get like, you. I, I'm not scrambling up. All right, so you guys can just move your movement speed. Uh, without making a check because you're casually going about it. Um, it is 120 from the floor plus 40 feet up. Um, 160 okay, feet. It's 160 feet to get to the lip of the the uh, the edge of the surface, and it's 40 feet down to the floor. Um, but it is Chilotinus Cube's turn. Um, mm. Let's see. Uh, he will just kind of square my way. Just kind of uh, move over here, and it will. I just feel while doing so it can enlarge just on his face. You know what? It's just going to try to engulf you. Make a DC 14 dexterity saving throw. All right, come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come on. Ah, nice. No, yeah. you passed. You passed. Nice. Um, yeah. On a successful save. All right, you can choose to be pushed five feet back or to the side of the cube. I'll go this way, please. Okay. <laughs> so it, it, so essentially, it moves right there. And uh, yeah, it's your turn. Uh, so I don't want to. Okay, is it acidic seeming? Like it just tried to touch me. Yes. I didn't take any damage, but like it's acidic. Okay. Yeah. Uh, where where was my pit in that again? Uh, it was right. Oh shit. Where was my <laughs> right where there? Was my pit in that uh, again? let me. Uh, fuck. Everyone else roll initiative too. By the way. <laughs> uh, are our guys on here? <laughs> oh shit. I have, another, I have another pit in, so I have oh, an idea. No. Let me, uh, I, let me. I actually do have two pittens in my inventory. Okay. Um, oh, that's me, right. No, I really only have one. I had two caltrops. Right. Damn. Uh, yeah, no, one pitten. That's no good. All right. <laughs> I, I, I gave you guys the lizard folk village, so you can just click on your characters there and uh, okay. do the initiative thing. Um, uh, wow. Yeah, that's one pitten. That sucks. Um, oh man. Okay. <laughs> so let turn. me, let me. It has an AC of ten, but it just does. It automatically does damage. So let me roll. Oops, this. I actually rolled oh. an initiative for one. Mm. 
Yeah. Sorry, right. guys. I just thought it was more comedic to actually mention that than it was to just like let it go. Yeah. And we'll figure out another way up. I think it's kind of funny though. All right. Well, if you die, you guys have uh, you guys have essentially started climbing up. You've all gotten up to your move speed, and all of a sudden, the rope snaps. Well, so it, joy. While that's happening, Atlas would like to disengage and grab the end of the rope. And I'm still levitating right now, so I I want to chase it down with them. Okay. Um. Oh man, levitate. Let me look up levitate real quick. I, f I always forget. <laughs> Levitate. Ba -ba -ba. I can pop it on the screen real oh, quick if you want. Oh, I got it right now, actually. Um, rise vertically. Can only move by pushing or pulling. And so that's what I've been doing, right? Yeah, yeah, touch yeah. The yeah. And... I, I get that part. Um, otherwise, it doesn't really. Okay. So like, it, I'm I, floating, right? I would say but make I a strength check rope. to hold on to the rope. You don't have to make a strength check to, like, lower them down or pull them up so much as it is just holding on to the rope itself because the way the levitate works, no matter what, you always float to the ground if you want to. So I think what I would do is I'd disengage and, like, push off the ground and, like, fly away from the the cube okay. and then try and grab the rope. So right. I want to get 30 right. down wherever the rope is. All right. Um, disengage. No problem. You move along the grass. You catch the rope, but make a strength saving throw real quick. Sure. <clears throat> oh, it's not safe, but that, that's three. What's awesome. your athletics? Not good. All right. <laughs> so, uh, here, let me see. Athletics is a minus one, if that's what you're asking for. Or do you want me to roll it? No, no, you don't have to roll it, because you rolled a four, essentially. Um, oh, a four on the die, and then... It's not proficient. Yeah, yeah. so you yeah, you go to catch it, and you're you don't you can't hold yourself down by the levitate, um, and you get yanked up by the rope. What do you mean yanked up? Like, well, you you get technically yanked up because they're going down. You get yanked up. Um, you're holding on to the rope. Um. Oh, okay, that's yeah. fine. Yeah, yeah. I mean, as, as long as I, made, I I wanted to get my 30 feet away from him with that disengage mm -hmm. and then try to grab the rope so I can quickly get to them and tell them what just happened. Yeah, you're going to get to them, but meanwhile, they still fall. Um, <clears throat> so, who was first on the rope again? Was it Fell or Amos? I was first. Okay. Um, what's your movement speed? 35. All right, 35. Who was behind him? Me. And, All right. and then I'm I'm last. Twenty. Yeah. Okay. Um. At this point, make a acrobatics, um, or dexterity saving throw. All three of you. Okay. As Sorry, all of a guys. sudden, oh. that's all right. Yeah. All of a sudden, you the rope goes slack, and you feel it get tense again, but you're still <laughs> going down. Um. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Fel, you <coughs> ignore the first 20 feet of damage. I um, take it all. <laughs> but you still take 1d10 of falling as you fall to the ground. Um, so you take 8 points Ouch. of damage. John, you ignore uh, the first 10, so you take 2d10. And uh, Grim didn't make it up quite that far, so he only takes 2d10 as well. And falls <laughs> prone. Every, you, The <laughs> other two are not prone. So, in order, it's Fell, 8, Aenos is 12, and then uh, uh, Green is 13, and he's all I prone. The three bl yeah, uh, blood it, correct. You negate so 3, nine. so 9. Um, and uh, you, you've come to realize that something is very wrong up there. <laughs> um, so, we'll just kind of go in order top down now. Um <clears throat> Let's see, Atlas, you are now, you just got pulled up to the top of the lip, of because it's 40 feet down to that bottom floor, or t not to the bottom bottom, but to the base of the room that you were in. And you just got pulled up there, and you see everyone on the ground, but uh, Fel and Anos so, are standing up. One second, so I, I, I think I understand what you're saying now, but it's a miscommunication from what I was saying. Yeah. I didn't go into the hole, I've always been on the surface of the building. 
the hill or whatever, right? But you're thinking of me as inside pitting and then grabbing. Oh the yeah, because the, uh, the the yeah. Uh, sorry, you. Are you... <laughs> I was always on the side of a building, right? With the miscommunication, grass, but... then. Yeah, so I yeah, always thought that you, I was over here on the grass. Yeah, no, the grass the grass intrudes into that cavern floor, and that's why the this I, what, the floor I never right there. To go inside of that that room, the thingy that did that. I just looked inside and was yeah. like, "Oh, mystic carving or whatever," but I never went in there. I I I get what you're saying there. Um, I was not it, going to do that without people. I get you. It. You did now. I, you, you did now only only because you said that but spot right there. That, that was the spot that I pitted in, so I was yeah. pitting into the to the and side that, of the and no, that's thing, the right? floor. That is the it's intruding into, and that's it slopes down all the way into the base of the floor, and that's uh, this is kind of like in this is floor level I, essentially. So am I inside of a room right now? Not anymore, but is you it, were. Okay. Um, but now you're on the lip, and uh, it. But I'm like right here. What is? Uh, hmm. Yeah, I, you um you got yanked up. Essentially, you grabbed the rope. You got yanked up there because you have levitate on you, and you failed your strength saving throw, and so you couldn't resist the pool of three heavy human or three heavy beings. Um. So am I now outside of whatever? You're is? you're on the lip now, essentially. You're you're. Think of this as so, the, ed, the wall this edge. This being a top. Uh, uh, just a second. Okay. This right here, right? Yeah. Is that a cliff, basically? Like it's this grass and. No, no, it's no. Like it's a, a slope. It's a slope. It's intruded into this area. Going like, into like. Yeah, that. It's, it's in. I'm getting yeah. pulled up the slope. Yeah, you're getting the, like pulled up the, the slope, being drug out that way an event but uh and then the tension in the rope stops uh as and you look over the edge that you are now by um sorry i i like i said i i didn't have all the time in the world to draw this map you have these kind of basic contour lines of the grass you see right there um mm -hmm. that was kind of indicating slope and i didn't have time to really Get that Sorry, as... I, I guess I, I should have been maybe more clear that I would never enter a cavern without my friends. I, I right? get you. I get you. But it, hindsight, if I'm getting pulled towards them or whatever, I'm good with that. Yeah. That's what I want to do. Is I want to get back to them ultimately. That's what I'm trying to do. If that's up and out or down the hill or however it is, essentially, you know, that's, that's fine. Yeah. So I'm gonna point direction of slope that way. You see, I just kind of drew something right there real quick. Um, just miscommunication, no problem. Uh, that's the problem with, I guess, uh, roll twenty being. Well, it's not just that; it's D and D in general yeah. with complicated maps, right? Yeah. It's not just the forest or whatever. But, it, anyways, I guess uh, go ahead and he can have his turn. Um, okay. But I, I'd like to still be thirty feet away from. No, him. I, I get you. You are. You're. You're actually up. He. He could get to you if he, if he marches up the uh, that area, but they're pretty slow. But anyways, okay. uh, I'll move him back to where he was. And because uh, you're up, you are more than thirty feet up from me. You are forty feet up the up the uh, area, off the uh, floor. Because this sure. is, let me. Just so I, what's this gray thing here? What's the big gray? What big gray or, thing? Can they see the map yet, or no? They cannot. Nope. They're not up there. Okay, you so I'm the only one. You're okay. talking about this. Yeah, this right here. Oh, that's the pit. That's that? the shaft that you can see all the way down, the hundred and like forty, 40 some feet. odd. Yeah. Okay. So and, this and is a, so. Okay. All right. And these walls right here are forty feet tall, itself. And so I never went into the pit, right? No, 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 no. Okay. Yeah. And then the forty feet wall. Oh, that's what. Yeah, that's where you was. saw the carvings of. Because I can't really represent. I'll, uh, I'll actually draw them kind of on this isometric view i have up here just kind of yeah. like that if oh I, right. I need to review let me just get to them so that they can all see the map too <laughs> yeah let me just reveal this part for you guys or for atlas all right so the isometric view i kind of drew like these faux walls essentially if you look up there top left hand corner
like that. Uh, so it... yeah, there's 40 feet. You're you're essentially like right here. Okay. Sorry. All right. Now you guys just fell, and you understand. Sorry, this map's a little complicated. Um, <laughs> yep. uh, you'll It'll see it in cool, a second. Um, you guys fall to the ground. Some of you take some damage. Greem's face planted. Other two are standing. But Anos, it's your turn. As you look, and you now see a little figure at the top um, that seems to be Atlas. Is there any kind of, like, the grass, like, I could kind of like, just dig my fingers in and climb Yeah, up. absolutely you can. All right, I'm going to do that. Make a yeah. strength, uh, athletics. Make an athletics or acrobatics. It's up Gladly. to you. All right, yeah, uh, you can move freely your speed up the side of this because it's right. not straight vertical. It's kind of bulging out and then in. It's kind of like a crazy uh, mountain uh, side carved by the weather. All Think right, of it yeah, like I'll that. Double move in that case yeah. to get up as fast as I can. Yeah, no problem. You're up sixty feet of the way. Um, the, well, we can double move up the side of the mountain uh, if you succeed on a check. Ah. Um, so this guy. Uh, this is kind of difficult terrain, so it's going to be 20. I think that's all he can move. And he gets up there. He's now 20 feet away from you. And uh, all of a sudden, you see another one move to the, your uh, to your right there, Atlas. And I will bring him up. Right there. And he moves. Actually, this guy could only move... that far from because of difficult terrain because uh, he's kind of like sloping upwards he's like you see the top of him shifting back and forth uh, kind of like jello up moving slowly up the side of this uh, hill uh, but green you pick yourself up that's half your movement um, and you see uh, Aenos just dig his hands into this uh, almost moss like grass and he's finding handholds in the rock and he's moving himself up Uh, you're muted, buddy. Because I can't hear you. Yeah, I don't hear you either. <laughs> oh. Somehow I must have accidentally hit my own button. Okay. There you um, go. Huh. So. I'll take the rest of my move to follow him up. Okay. So 15, and then you can technically dash. It's 15 plus 25 is 40. So you're 40 feet up, right? Um, so I'm just gonna draw this real quick. So Anos is 60. I'll just say a green is four. Oh no, not that. 40. It's green. Um, Atlas. It's your turn. Um. Okay. Wait, All right. wait. When did Atlas go? Oh, I don't see Atlas on the turn order. You don't. Oh. oh, they have a different turn order because yeah. I don't see them either. Oh, okay. Sorry. I got you all. Don't worry. Um, so can I see them all coming up now? Yeah, you can see like uh, Aeno is just... <laughs> he's grabbing handholds. He's jumping over. He's basically displaying a feat of uh, athletics right now. Nice. Okay. Um... <laughs> I don't remember how we killed them last time. Can, can you refresh my memory? Because I have fought them before. You just hit them. Do you, we, we beat just, the hell out of them. Yeah, you just beat, just the, hell beat the hell out of yeah. them. Yeah, it was right, the oozes that you're thinking of that right dissolved now. your uh, um, you know, your armor and, and stuff. Armor and stuff. Oh, it was the ooze. And yeah. that wasn't even this campaign. That was... No, that, that was, was this the campaign. One, uh, the, the ruins had an ooze in the center of the hole that you swan dived into. Oh, sorry. Uh, a Jalan's cube. <laughs> And then on the edges of the wall had there was oozes. I think we're remembering that first point I, a little differently. Uh, it wasn't the swan dive into it. It was a critical one. And yeah, it became a swan that, dive. That's what. That's what it was. <laughs> All right, cool. Well, um, you know what? Fuck it. They're they're coming down here, and let me. Uh, hmm. This bro's coming at me, I guess, and I'm trying to think of where I would want to fight him. Um, 
Come on, bro. <laughs> Come on, bro. Uh, I, I want to get him to the edge so that, that Fel can see him. So I'm going to try and uh, I'm going to switch to a bow. Okay. And I'm going to move a little bit, like a little bit further away if I can. But I, what I want to do is effectively kind of tease him towards the edge so that Fel can yeah, see him. Yeah, I get you. Um, and so uh, I'll take a shot, though. And... Uh, normal 28 to hit Damn. oh yeah that's a that's a hit so 9 damage and then minus 15 arrows I edited that oh 15 minus 30, 30 equals oh did you I mess something edited, up All right. yeah I must have added 30 in the, or, or put right. my arrow count somewhere I'll fix it anyways right. um, cool 9 so points of damage uh, let me make sure ba -ba -ba -ba. You can take yeah, okay, totally. No problem. Yep. Um, 30 per use. Damage immunities. Alright, so you deal 9 points of damage. Uh, yep, sounds good. And then I, I kind of move away, but it, I, it's hard for me, man. I, what I'm trying to do is, is get the cube towards the edge so Fel can mm -hmm. see it. That's pretty much it. I get you. Um, Fel, it's your turn. Hey, we've got a new toy. Do you? Um, yeah, we do. He leveled I'm gonna, up. I'm gonna bring them onto to our map. I can't increase the size of them. There they are. What'd Spiders. You get? What'd you get? They're they're gonna be they're gonna be little Owls spider or, bros. Oh, spider bros. Nah, little spider bros. Uh, the whole large thing. It's having right. a bit of creeping now. Shooters. You fucking guys. And you're fucking. Will fight. Ah. <laughs> And um, you can summon two of those? I can. They're challenge rating one. Yeah, okay. It's the CR2s that you can only bring one, right? Correct. Yep. So, uh, they have an initiative of 10. Initiative I'm of 10. I'm so sorry to do that to you. No, it's but fine. Yes. Uh, you're going um, to be attacking. You can access the character sheet and stuff like that. So, you're going to be the one attacking yep. with them, not me. Yep, I can, I can see them. They're all good. Uh... I mean, they need there, to be enlarged. I, I, they are large creatures. Yes. Yeah, and I believe you could have done that, but uh, I, I don't see little arrows to. Exp I can only move them. All right, that's odd. All right, anyways, I enlarged them for you on the other map. Um, <laughs> so I, I want to ride them up. Um, <laughs> what's their I'll speed? I'll instruct the other one. Uh, thirty feet climb. Thirty climbs. So yeah, you move thirty feet. You're on one. Um, um, so you're 30 feet up there. And then I'll, I'll send the, the other one is uh, going to pick up green and uh, possibly Anos if he, if he wants. <laughs> Anos, you know. is a fa is he, no, Anos is 60 feet away from you right he's now. Like, he's hauling ass. Uh, and that's that's the range of the spell. So, there, But the spider, um, the other spider I summon is going to be going towards uh, green first. And the idea is that he'll... he'll Snack Green, yeah. and if uh, yeah, so you have you've got one. Uh, Green is at the bottom, so well, yep. if uh, not, I'll just go. Yeah, I'm gonna. I'm okay. Oh shit, I lost Doug. Oh. Yep, he dropped out. Shit. Well, yeah. he'll come back. Um, you one picks up Green, the other one picks up you. They both move thirty feet up. So you and Green. Well, oh, shit. Green was forty feet up, anyways. He wasn't on the ground. I just want to marker them on. Um, oh, quick quick question: Can you do the, well, when you summon them? Do they have to be together? Doesn't say. Um, oddly enough, does it just says a range of sixty feet? You summon face spirits hmm. uh, that take unoccupied spaces that you can see within range. Okay. So yeah. I, actually, yeah. Okay, it does. So say. you move. Yep. Yeah. All right. So you can um, you can uh, pick a spot. And they both appear there, or pick or choose? Was that well? And that—that—that's that, the question here. Um, you summon face spirits that take the form of beasts and appear in unoccupied spaces that you can see within range. I, I'd say you could you could pick and choose. Yeah. All right. So so you I, move I one by Green. It's forty feet up. Green, a big fucking spider suddenly appears next to you, gestures Yay. with uh, <laughs> with one of its uh, mandibles to kind of get on its back. <laughs> I don't. Okay. <laughs> oh God, red, red has. Uh, I'm gonna. I'm riding red. You're riding red. Uh, well, I've, I've already. I, yeah, don't worry. I've. I've already moved him to the other sheet. Um, okay. 
Uh, ba -ba -ba. So you pick that one and they can move instantly, right? Uh, they're going to move on their turn. On so their turn, which is giant 10. spider 10. I get you. Yep. Okay. Um, in which case, we are now at the top of the order again. Yeah. Um, so Fell's not quite 30 feet up yet. Correct. They'll move on their turn. Um, I always thought they moved on your turn, but they have their own nope. initiative, I guess. All right. Yeah, they um, have their own initiative. Anos, you're 60 feet up the wall. You've got uh, ba, 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 40, 40, 80, 120 feet to go. All right, I'm going to keep going. All right. Just full movement. Athletics. Again? Okay. Sure. But yeah, it'll be athletics check every time you, you want to move. All right. Uh -oh. Yep, again, double move. You're 120 feet up. And that's it. Okay. Uh, so you've... You've gone, you're almost there. You've got 60 more feet by my calculation, right? Uh, I've moved 120 so far, yeah. so. So 60, 100, yeah. So you've got um, 20, you've got 60 more feet of movement until you get to where Atlas is. Gotcha. Um, the cubes go. This guy, 510, 10, 15, 20. Not quite up there yet. To you, Atlas, but he's getting close. Um, Green, it's your turn. Uh, There's a spider I there. I guess I'm, I'm still climbing. I guess, or I well, yeah, I guess you, I jump on the spider. You, yeah, you can jump on the spider, and the spider will take you. But you're. I'm like, okay. This is fucking make weird. My, I'm like, all right, <laughs> friend, make my ascension with haste. <laughs> all right, and the giant spider does just that, moving, uh, double moving. Um, putting you at a hundred feet up there, you're just. Under does it understand abyssal? <laughs> no. Okay. It it doesn't understand anything. Yeah. It understands oh. me. Yeah. Oh okay. <laughs> and he it gave it commands to pick you up and go. <laughs> so it's doing it's like, that. I'm good. Oh god. <laughs> um and fell. You are sixty feet. Uh. Because you're, it's moving on your, on their turn, and it's picked you up Correct. and moved sixty Correct. feet. Because thirty foot normal climb, but uh, it double moved. Double move. So yep. you're sixty feet. So I've got 120, 100, and then sixty. Um, and Atlas is at essentially one sixty feet. But Atlas, it's your turn. You see them. You see Fell some, do something he's never done before. Fucking spiders appear that are. 10 feet huge spiders are crazy and uh they start carrying nice. him and Gream up the side uh so it seems to me that they're coming to me now so i'm going to change my action plan i was trying to get fell to stay down there and shoot it but he's coming up which i'm very pro i'm good with that so yeah. uh i'm gonna put the bow on and then bring the knives out and step forward and uh attack the cube okay um shit Close. Oh, I had to refresh my character sheet. Close. Just a second. Okay. Loading. 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 Uh. Close. <laughs> All right. And. Uh, exactly. <laughs> <You know? laughs> All right. Oh, oh, 12. Let me see on this guy. Hey, that's exactly what you need. As you <laughs> swing your vicious nice. long sword, and it doesn't move. It doesn't shimmy out of the way it tries to and you get a little bit of it dealing 11 points of damage to it alright and then I circle back the other way with the wakazashi alright <laughs> same sort of thing here ba -ba -ba. oh nope 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 Under the, mm -hmm. minus 7 not 7 points there we go boom there we go um, alright anything else uh no, so I still have levitate going. Yes, um, it's concent it's concentration. So it just is. remind me of that yep. because I won't. Thank you. Uh, Fell, it's your turn. You stay on the spider. That's all you can do, yeah. I guess, at the moment. All right. Um, Anos, you're almost there, man. All right, one more check. Yeah, all my way up there. DC sixteen. Yeah, you got it. Slowly um, decreasing. Yeah, I know it's. You hit that high note, but for about like 
another 500 feet, I might not be able to make it so quickly. Yeah, I'll, I'll move your guy. You get up to Atlas on your second part of your second movement, so you can't take an action. Right. But I'll show you what you see here. I'll move you. Oh, I see him. That was cool. Did you put him there? He's he's there now, yeah. Um, nice. So... Welcome to the party. <laughs> John, did you uh, you see? Yep, I see both of them. All right. So you got the, the top-down map up here. I mean, right here. And then you've got the isometric view over in the top left corner. Um, gotcha. All right. So you have... Um, so you were at 120. You have 30. It's 150. Plus that. You have 20 more feet of movement, or you can stay right here, but you cannot attack unless you action search. But uh, is Atlas in any immediate danger? Not really. He seems pretty. He doesn't even look like he's been hit yet. Uh, and he, is he within uh, striking distance of the thing? Yes, he is. I am. All right. I can. Move and uh, how much more do movement do I have? You've got 20, 20 feet. feet. All right, I'll just move up to here, unsheath my sword, and thank you, and just think to myself, uh, I really wish that I had that acid resistant armor on me right now. <laughs> That's right, yeah. Other that other armor provides acid re resistance, it's far more niche than resisting like a lot more stuff. Yeah, know? um, I get you. I get you. All right. Uh, so, um, yeah. Will, all right. That's your turn. We'll do, actually, I'll do total defense. No, I can't do my Yeah, you can't. Right. Yeah. All right. Uh, Zon scoops kind of wobbles and wiggles, and it kind of shimmies your way. Um, <laughs> and this one tries to hit you with its pseudopod. Uh, oh. Who? Well, it it tries to hit uh, Aenos. Okay. With this little pseudopod attack. Why is it whispering to GM? Well, 13 to hit does not attack or not hit i believe as that is correct well it hits your armor yeah, but it just kind of right. bounces off and it goes back in anyways um they missed they missed right with a pseudopod yeah it yeah <laughs> <laughs> okay in which case this other one comes up over here moves that far right there green uh, you Yay. can't really do anything right now because you're on a spider. Oh. I'm you on can, a worm. You can ready an action or ready something in case because it looks like it might. Oh, you'll be <coughs> right at the lip, so it really. Uh, no, I'll just wait till I'm there. Okay. Uh, giant spider goes. Fell. Well, Green, I'll move you here because you are now on the edge with a giant fucking spider. Yeah. Like, um. Living on the let me. <laughs> to the front. Oh, wow. Those spiders are badass. Yeah. So, Graham's right there. Let me Good. move Doug. Good sign. Yeah. Yeah. All right, Doug. <laughs> so, uh, just like previous, uh, this isometric views on the top left corner of the map and then you are right there in the uh, top down view and um, so you're up there fell you are 120 feet up you're 40 feet away from the edge the lip um, but Atlas it's your turn wait green green got to the top before I did yeah he was 40 feet up yeah you were on the base ground still you I used your was, action I, to summon the spiders, and then you moved on to your spider. I, I thought I didn't take the full falling damage. Oh, did, You did fell all the way. All the way okay. You just didn't take the full falling damage. You reduced it. Yeah, gotcha. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um, okay. But yeah, Doug, you see the map now? Yep. All right, cool. Um, My turn? It's Atlas's turn, yes. Whoop, whoop. Nice. Uh, that nice. is a hit with your vicious longsword. You yeah, oh, you get that now. Only 15. But no. still. And then followed up with a wakazashi. 
slice this cube, show him who's boss. Jeez. Oh, uh, this, Pen, unfortunately. One. Yeah, you, your uh, Wakazashi gets in there and <laughs> trying to pull it out, and you were able to before it engulfs the uh, the blade. The blade <coughs> kind of steams a little bit with this acid. Uh, and uh, Fell, you hear action going on up there. You're not quite sure. You're still like hanging on to the side of the spider as it kind of goes up this edge. Uh, Aenos, it's your turn. I'm gonna take my two swings at it. All right. All right. And shield out. So when one handed. Yep. Uh, that's actually a hit, isn't it? Twelve. Twelve is a hit. Yeah. Nine points. All right, uh, really quick. I wanna. All right. So savage attacker once per turn. Uh, we yep. roll down. Okay. Uh, and then my other one. Twelve. I Damn. Nice. Roll. Well, two hits. Wow. Yeah. That's. This weird. thing's not looking too good. Yeah. I'll re-roll the nine. So should I just re-roll the D? Just roll a D eight. D- one, yeah. Or roll one D eight, not eight D eight. Okay. Oh come eight. on. All right. So. Uh, so uh, yeah, the twenty damage. All right. Or. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Um, blah, 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 blah. It's on its cube. Let me pull up the character sheet again for that. Um, uh, where are you, Jelanus? You were just there. Ah, yes, you're right here. To think I forgot about you. <laughs> okay, okay. Alrighty, um, engulf. Alright, it's going to move right here. Uh, make a DC 14 dexterity saving throw. Uh, Aenos. Dexterity saving throw. I believe in you. Oh, you are engulfed in the, you, right there. And, uh... All right, you will take, for now, 3d6 points of acid damage. So I was six... constantly getting engulfed by things. Yeah. Nice, dude. So, that's, that's nice, nice damage. Uh, so damage. Six, uh, six points of acid damage to you, and you are restrained, and you cannot breathe. And... Um, your mask. This like, seems to be happening to you a lot lately. Yeah, yeah it does. <laughs> I'm the frontline guy. Yeah, it just happens. Well, you know, um, it happens. <laughs> I, I have a little trick in my pocket. I can't wait to show it. Right. I hope I don't have to. But That's right, perverted. So I'm going to have to ask you to keep that little guy... trick in my <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I know we shared in the pond with the, with the dryads and all, but no. Yeah, no, no. I know. I need more wine to show my trick. <laughs> <going>. <laughs> high up. <laughs> All right. Uh, how how this kind of battle situated right now, um, Green? You're on the lip of things right now, so you're forty Got feet it. up. Yeah, it can't hit you because it's below you. Yeah, but it, as soon as the spider comes up over the top, it's like well, oh, it's over the top. It just needs to go down a little bit. Oh, essentially, gotcha. it needs to go down about ten feet before it hits the grass where you are, because gotcha. it's kind of sloped like that, you know. Um. With the top being over here, closer by Atlas, where that arrow is. Um, all right, but it can't do anything right there. Green, it's your turn. You are on the spider. It's about ten feet down to the grass. <sighs> okay, look at him. Now look at me. Now look back at him. Look at me, diamonds. Yeah. All right, so. Uh, I'm gonna sacred flame that lovely creature of gelatinous goop. Okay. In the face. Um, spider's not really moving right now, so I'd say you're fine just to do it. Uh, which one do you want to do? The one to your right and below, or the one to straight ahead? The one that's right in front of me. Okay. Go ahead, sacred flame. Sacred flame. Whatever. It's a dexterity saving throw, which it should oh, have nothing. So. Uh, dexterity saving throw. Yeah, it's got pretty bad dexterity. Um, it rolled a 7. A- Actually, it rolled a 15, but it's so bad at it that... Yeah. I get to roll I get to roll 2d8. Well, it already then, rolled. 
Oh, it already did it. Okay. Oh, oh no. yeah, right there. Oh, wait, no, 11, it didn't. 11 to hit. That's... Range is 60. Oh, it's so, 11 yeah. to 11, hit. I thought it just happens. Damage. No, I think this is the damage, isn't it? It says melee weapon. No, no. Yeah, no. yeah, no, that's the attack. Go ahead. Uh, for some... I don't know what? what happened when the sheet upgraded. The damage uh, thing might have got switched off. So go ahead and just roll it. the damage for it. 2d8. Uh, that's, that's cool. That's cool, bros. Yeah. Cool, bro. You might want to go through your spells while it's not your turn, just to make sure that the ones that have damage on it are checked properly. Um, but yeah, go ahead and roll two d eight. Oh, seven wow. points of damage. Oh, damage. fire, seven radiant, fire. flame like yeah. radiant. This little um, radiant uh, flame extends from your hand and shoots forward, beam like nature. And um, <clears throat> let's see if I can get a little beam. <clears throat> Go away, goo. So it's like that. <laughs> Did anyone see that? No? There you go. Yep. There you go. I can't. <laughs> there you go. Oh, yeah, you can't. Um, but, yeah, Giant Spider, uh, it delivered Gream to the top. So it take, it's awaiting an order from Fell at the moment. Fell doesn't really know what he's seeing, so Attack. <laughs> that one stays right there. And yours, um, I believe, gets all the way to the top now. Um, fell, and I'll I can now add just everyone. Yay! Like over here. And uh, kind of do a little reveal just so you're. Yeah. Oh god, just go to the top. There you go. Fell. You're on top of a spider. Um, Atlas, uh, do you want to give any commands to your spiders? Uh, attack? Okay. On their next turn, they'll, uh, they'll, they'll try to attack. Atlas, it's your turn. Alright, um, so he, he, if I attack, I'm not gonna like slice off my friend's face, right? No, 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 you're not. Okay, all right. I'll I'll, I'll be a little reserved, right? Like I just want to make sure I want to I want to strike home, strike true, get my damage in, but I don't want to slice my friend's face off. Uh, Twenty eight. Toss in some sneak attack yeah. here. Ah, oh, getting some ones in there. But hey, that was only one one. I'll take it. That's fine. Um, it's looking pretty follow, bad. Follow up with another Wakazashi here. Yeah, that's a hit. Eight. Nice, man. So, um, yeah, I just, just slice him through. This is a tornado of blades. Yeah. Trying to get Anos out of there safely. Um, Fell, it's your turn. You're on the spider still, and from where you are at, it's fifth, It's uh, 40 feet down to the floor, but there's a gelatinous cube right underneath you, and that is only um, 25 feet down from you. To the top of the gelatinous cube. Okay. Um, so the one that I'm riding, um, I'm gonna tell him to stay. Okay. And uh, just just hold. Um, it's like on the edge, like kind of trying to do a little balance thing. But it's yeah, well, he's got eight legs. He's uh, I know, I know, I'm but he's also guys. got you on it, so he's. he's... Oh, he's a large creature. He's got no problem. Hey, come on, I'm I'm not heavy. I'm not, um, is there I'm, any, I'm, I'm saying any it's fine. I'm shooting on that. Or? Yeah, you're fine to shoot. Uh, nice. Bam. Uh, which this one are you one? hitting? The um the one with um what's his name in it? Anos. Uh, Anos. Yes. Yes. All right. You. Yep. Eleven. Your arrow goes right into it. Uh, right. Colossal Slayer. Yep. Colossal Slayer is looking pretty bad. And uh, we'll take the second arrow. And All go. right. Twenty's a hit, and with that, the arrow. Some you don't know how these things have a certain threshold of damage to take, but somehow your arrow strikes through it, and it just kind of dissolves. It loses its viscosity. Yeah. Oh, that was good. Right before it, Anos would have had to take some damage. Um, yeah. Anos, it's your turn, and you just kind of. <coughs> You can breathe again. It was only like six seconds, but it's it's odd being suddenly restrained and acid kind of burning around. You check your mask. It's a little scorched in areas, but it's still there. 
and right. you're standing on the ground, and oh shoot, that's okay. about yeah. You can make it. It's about twenty five feet or so away from you down. All right, I just move to there. Yep. Damn it. Well, with just my move, and I'll have my two attacks. Okay, go for it. Uh, oh, nice. Nine. And I'll re-roll the three. Okay. Nice. Good. So seven plus five, right? Mm-hmm. All right, so 12 more Eight. points. Yeah. Oops. Um, yeah, all right. You're slashing around with your longsword. You have your shield up. You have your longsword in one hand. You just slack, slashing it. And uh, Green, you're still on the spider. It's your turn. So I think I'm going to have to reinstall all of these because I don't think any of them are correct. Ah, shit. Uh, all my spells. But that's okay. That's for a different time. Yeah. Um, wow. Okay. Sorry, bud. Yeah, they updated the sheet. And it... No, it's, it's cool. I mean, it's yeah. good. It's, all right. it's good. Okay, so... Um, what are we attacking now? The cube? The other yeah, cube. that one's a uh, little... It's about 25 feet below you. Can I, do, can I do a nature check to figure out what they're, they might be vulnerable to? Yeah, sure, man. 16. Um, on yeah, they don't check. seem to be vulnerable to anything, but they are immune to certain things that most creatures that lack intelligence are immune to, like charmed and... Uh, uh, fr it can't be frightened, prone, ex it's immune to exhaustion, things of that nature. It's immune to, okay. but there's no vulnerability. Hmm, so nothing that we can do to give it more damage, then? Correct. Okay. The fuck? I know, gelatinous cubes, what purpose do they serve? So when it died, like cleaning. <laughs> yeah. What cleaning. did I? What did I see when this one died in front of me? Is it just kind of like that's... slumped down and ran off the edge of the of the hill, leaving it's a just acid lost trail. I can't okay. gather its acid. No. But anyway, no. Okay. I don't. It'd be no. kind of cool if you picked it up and like yeah. threw it at people. You, you can try to make a on your next turn before it all goes. <laughs> if you have a vial, you can try to make a survival check. <laughs> To... That's exactly what I was kind of was. Okay. At. Then, it, then all make... I get is a vial of acid out of it. Uh, in, in this case, poison. you know, because you gotta think, oh, fuck, you know, you gotta get in there and you gotta do it so you don't get burned as well. Um, yeah. And so you could get a vial, which this vial would probably do decent, not as much as your wyvern, uh, wyvern poison does. Poison. Yeah. Okay. All right. I might do that then. Cool. All right. Oh, well, I it's the dagger. Oh yeah, it's still Green's turn. What's up? Um, all right, then I will produce my rapier and see what I can do to. I don't know. Attack this fucking. Well, thing. it's down below. You're going to have to get off the spider, or wait until the spider gets up next to it. Because you're at a height difference right now. Well, I thought I already got off. Once I got on the top, I'm. No, I. I, the... I didn't know if you got off or not because you. It doesn't matter. I'll get off the spider. All right. I would recommend not belly flopping into the gelatinous cube. All right. It's about 10 yeah, feet no, down. Right. Um, <laughs> to like right right there where you're at. About... Right. So I'm going to go the opposite direction off the spider as the gelatinous okay. cube. Yeah. Get you, get <laughs> I, mean, you. I, I don't imagine anybody in the right mind like, ah, oh, this looks fun. So you're going up that way then? Or? Yeah. I'm going to go on the, um, let's see, where am I? I'm going to go over here off the spider. <clears throat> And then that should put me within range of smacking it. Yeah. Oh, why is your health down? That doesn't make sense. Did you get hit? Oh, yeah. He you fell. fell. Hey, I, got, I, I got forgot. Hit. I was like, oh, my God. Oh, I'm so sorry. What happened? No. Yeah. 13 fall damage. <laughs> yeah, I get you. I get you. And then face plan. All <laughs> right. So go ahead and move where you're going to move right, then. So let's, uh, well, I, I should be right where. Uh, oh, okay. Never mind. So, yeah. So I'll be there, and I should be in range to hit him. Um, um, now if you're rapier. He he takes up the square right here, doesn't he? Uh, you're still at a height advantage. He's kind of at that point. Let's see. This is uh, that's about forty. It's about thirty. 15. 
At that point, he's about 10 feet away from you or so. Um, because there's a, there's these, sorry, there's these, like, little contour lines. I kind of are they, are there. they leading down? Yeah, they're leading down the direction of the okay, arrow up there. I'll just move over here. Okay. <laughs> yeah, you can do that. Um, all right, you have your rapier? Go for it. If it works, we'll see. They're pretty easy to hit. 13 to hit, reach 5. Okay, and it doesn't have any of my damn... Oh, okay. and yours is the one. All right. You're going to Meet need you. to go in, well, on this next turn around, I need you to go in and edit your character and change all your attacks to, well, at one, add damage, and two, add your modifier. Because it's only adding your proficiency right now, I think. Well, I know. When they updated it, took everything. Spells yeah. and all my attacks, it took everything off. Well, that like, sucks. Oh, fucker. All right. Um, uh, all right. Um, so let's see. Rapier's 1d8. Plus uh, yeah, dexterity. It's just, it's just 1d8. I don't have any dexterity. Okay. Go for it then. <laughs> All right. <sighs> don't you have like a blunt object to hit it with or something? Like a mace? No. no he doesn't. Strength. I don't yeah. have strength either. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He's, uh, he's, he's a, definitely a caster <laughs> I'm, I'm, guy. I'm built for something completely different that hasn't really shown itself yet. So. He's built for thinking, guys. God damn actually, it. <laughs> actually, I'm... I'm an inquisitor, so I'm built for torture. All right, roll, roll that D8, all my, bud. All my spells are basically... Um, you and I are going to get along so well. I know. That's <laughs> why I was on all right. Seven points. Um, all right. so I, was like, I was like, come on. Um, all right, seven points. Yeah, I mean, why do you think I took so many like damage right. and healing spells? I can hurt you and this then revive guy. you. And hurt you all right, uh, go ahead, and uh, the spider... It's 30. It gets down right above. You're holding... Uh, make a uh, acrobatics or athletics check to hold on to the spider there, Fel. Um, he's not moving. Uh, oh, you told, you told that one to stay. You told the yep. other one to attack. <laughs> right. Because right. I was just keeping in mind because the, once the wall turns like that, it would have been rough for you. Never mind. But this uh, guy goes yep. down. Uh, go ahead and attack, buddy. With the spider. Here we go. Fight! <laughs> well, his attack works. All right, nice. seven. Well, yeah, yeah well, seven piercing. <laughs> um, Just mine because it doesn't like me. Makes a DC eleven Constitution saving throw. Nineteen, fourteen plus five. Um, so, so it, it takes a total of uh, four half damage. Then. Yeah, yeah, minus four. Well, twenty-one damage. One. Yeah. Well, twenty-one, not twenty-one damage. No. No, 11 damage. Uh, seven. Uh, oh my god, I'm reading 21 to hit. Uh, yeah, yeah. Or 17 to hit plus 4. Sorry. Yeah. My brain. <laughs> I get you. Um, all right. Is that all I can do? Uh, yeah. All right. Sounds good. Atlas. There's a poison mixed with um, the acid. <laughs> so. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to think to myself, wow, I should really try and gather some of this. Yeah. And then uh, I'll drop my bag. Make a vial. survival. Make it, yeah, keep in mind, it's not poison, it's acid. But sure. you can still use it to do who knows what. Eight. Yeah, yeah. It, you, it, it's, it kind of burns in, to the ground uh, before you can get it. Listens. But uh, that's your turn. No worries. That's right. shot. I had to do it. Fell. Uh, bang, bang. Bang, bang. Bang, bang. Yep. Bang, bang, bang. Taking the shots. I guess roll 20 was like especially a fuck you to Doug. Um, yeah. All your spells are wiped and everyone else's character sheet's fine. But <laughs> yeah, I know. That's fucking weird. Um, I I'm looking at it all now and I'm just like, oh god. It's all right. Damage. All right, I have to move this thing to the like, side real quick. nothing. Yeah. yeah, just start filling that in. Um, so, minus 16, 26. What's the damage? Nice. As you just <laughs> two arrows in there. Aenos, it's your turn. John? What's up? It's your turn, bud. Your turn. Okay, yeah. Take the two swings. Alright. Uh, yep. Alright. And, uh, yeah. I'm gonna and we roll the one. Alright. There we go. So six plus five. 
So 11. Nice. You swing into Thank it with your long sword, um, chipping away at it. Green. Hmm. Oh, shit. This, oh, no. It's, it turns right after Aenos. Sorry. I deleted the one that had okay. the... Does that mean it had two rounds against it? I don't know. Fuck it. <laughs> Yeah, I was like, while. man, you get, man, this guy hasn't gone in a while. <laughs> what the fuck? Um, he will try to engulf right here. Uh, make you two make uh, DC fourteen dexterity saving throws. Real quick. Yo, I did it for once. Hey, good job. <laughs> About Gee, green. Spider oh, green. Sorry. Spider does not get um, an attack of opportunity. No, it's still moving within its range. It says no. Okay. All right, let's see if at least my my weapons will work. I'm going to do the rapier attack again. Well, no, no, no. No, dexterity saving throw. Green. Oh, I thought you said it was my turn. No, no. It's you are trying to be engulfed. Oh, fantastic. Fantastic. <laughs> so, from uh, that beautiful do I dicks. move from where I'm at, or no, no? Oh, yeah, you, you, you can, uh, you can either be pushed five feet back or move. Let's move there. Yeah, there you go. All right. All right. Green is uh, absorbed. Ah, shit. Yeah, you get dealt <clears throat> thirteen points of acid damage. Mm -hmm. um, and you are restrained, cannot breathe. Yep, and it's your turn, so you can, on your turn, you can essentially uh, try to escape with a DC 12 strength check. Okay. So go for it, um, if you want to. I believe I mean. in you. <laughs> if you want to. I don't really have a choice. I mean, no, you, I like you, it. you can choose I not I'll, to I'll if you want. and just... Contemplate my life for the rest of the day, and, and can see you attack from inside or you restrained? cannot? You're restrained. You're you completely that. restrained. All right. So you said a DC twelve. What? Strength. Check. Twelve strength. Check. Check. Yep. Awesome. I'll have a negative one strength. Let's see how this works, Johnny. Go for it, Doc. You got like a thirty percent chance. Hey! Oh, you gotta be fucking kidding me. Critical. That was ridiculous. Yeah, you, and you, uh, boom. Awesome. You just pop out. <gasps> Ooh, what the fuck? Uh, but that's your Not turn. Today. That's your action yeah. to do that, so. That's um, cool. I'll get my, uh, I'll yeah. get my damage on there. Yep. Giant spider. <clears throat> Wooby doo. Fell. Alrighty, yep. Fight. 21, nice. Uh, so it will make a constitution saving throw. As it bites in with its mandibles. Constitution. Come on. It rolled an 18. So it's good. So half 11 is 5. So 15 overall. And Atlas, it's your turn. Uh, boop. Boop. And then... Uh, this. The gelatinous oh, cube is severely outnumbered now. Oh, and yeah, unfortunately you miss on that one. Um, literally the only one that could miss yeah. for you is a botch. Yeah, literally. Um, 18, damn. 20, and 28 okay. points of damage, nice. Uh, it's still up and kicking, but it's not looking so good. It's starting to slouch in its form a little bit. <laughs> um, fell. Alright, well, hey, you know, I already took one kill. Let's, uh, let's see if I can't take two. There you go, that's a hit. And colossal. Nice. And hit two. Nice. Um. Yeah, colossal's wants to turn, right? Yep. All right. Yeah. Uh, it was just looking so bad. It's starting to God. wibble and wobble. It's like on that verge. <laughs> Anos, it's your turn. Okay, two swings. Poop poop. Mm. That's all you on. need. Um, as you bring your longsword, you strike down on it. And they kind of cleave it in two, and it, psh, like a breaking wave, just kind of runs down. Um, uh, Fourteen survival to gather acid. On that one. Uh, I rolled a yeah. eight last time. Yeah, 
14 is good enough. Uh, you have a vial of acid that could do uh, 3d6 points of damage if you find a use of how to do it. Okay. This isn't something I could apply to the sword. It's something I have to use like vial um, of It's kind of a bulk thing. Um, maybe if you found a way to craft an arrow or like uh, a special weapon that could hold uh, like a capsule in it that would uh, kind of sure. burst on okay. impact type deal. You know, you could okay. find a reason. Okay. More melting locks. But anyways, uh, everyone gain 100 gold pieces. Um, hey. Most of what you're going through there, and a lot of it's just, you're not sure what it was, but definitely looks like you're not the first ones who have fallen into this um, little trap. But you definitely seem to be one of the few that have survived, or at least bypassed it. Um, what do you guys want to do now? The first thing I do is I go over to Green, kind of slap him on the back and say, the first time is always the hardest. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh. Well, if we've got to go down there... Um, oh yeah, sp we... so, so I can tell you guys what you're seeing, by the way. Um... You, it, there is a, uh, what you're seeing now, the top left corner of the map has an isometric view, um, essentially, and you're looking around and you see these carvings in the walls that don't look like anything to you guys. Uh, you're not sure what purpose they serve, but they're on the corner there of this area right here. And I assume your animals go away. How long does that last, Phil? That's an hour. Okay. They are not going away at all. Nice. Okay. Unless you get hit. Um, and you fell. Well, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> um, so, um, there at the corners here, there is essentially... I need to turn this music down a little bit. There we go. Turn it up a little bit more than that. All right. Um, essentially, you see down about 120 feet. Those are the tiles that you're seeing down there right now. But you're looking over the edge, and there's like a barrier placed. It seems magic in nature. Um, oh, shit. No. Never mind. There's a barrier placed down on the next one that you see. You kind of see the next floor down, but not really the entire floor. Um, it's really dark in there. Um, and there seems to be a shimmering glow over the um, the next opening down. But so this perfect, the... this perfect rectangular hole, mm -hmm. uh, do we have reason to believe that gelatinous cube made it or no is no this... this one's much bigger this is about 20 feet wide by 20 feet wide a huge gelatinous um, cube. <laughs> yeah that's what it's worried about it, like it... You're, you're not you're thinking maybe this was a mechanical shaft maybe or you're not quite sure um but at the corners of each at each corner here there's a dwarven rune and it just simply says blood huh hmm Blood. You want to comply? <clears throat> what do I think it means? Make a history uh, check on it. History check. You're a dwarf. Oh, I am. It's crazy. Advantage. Okay, I'll take it. advantage. Let's see if this works. <laughs> okay. You know, you're trying to think, and only through Didn't your... Even... It doesn't look like it rolled two, Yeah, but that's it didn't, okay. doesn't look like it rolled two, but God it's good it. enough. It's okay. Um, it's okay. Due to your dwarven nature, you're, you're thinking long ago, dwarves made kind of past phrases for entry. Um, and in some case they were quite literal like 
if something says blood, you put your dwarven blood on the rune and a pass opens. Now, it's odd to you, this pass for this room is seems to be already open. Hmm. But there's no blood on the runes. Okay. Uh, the trap nastiness. <laughs> oh god, it's, go away. Yeah, I I'm not saying anything about dwarves. I I just know that they love their traps and uh I I, I don't think there's anything to be lost in a little dwarven blood on the uh, on the room. <sighs> I got a, I got a blade, my friend. Do you need one? I I mean, mm. you know. No, I've got I've got weapons. I've got take a out mace. Weapons. Don't you want? To, if you want a little artistry, I have a fine selection of blades <laughs> that you could choose from. <laughs> I have a I have daggers. I have a whip. Or whips, and I have a rapier. I don't it's, have a mace. Yeah, this guy's. This oh, okay. guy's a. Yeah. I don't know how many times I've got to say it. I well, don't it's have your picture. Your picture has a has a mace. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, that's I know, and that's that's. I I know it's it is a little bit, but it's close to what I wanted to do. What looks okay, wise. so Graham took that. Graham it took that picture, you know, because it's it fine. looks good. He, it's fine. He can't use the weapon. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he doesn't it's know. Like, he's like, oh, can I can I hold a shotgun? He doesn't know his ass in <laughs> from a mace. But he knows rapier a little bit. Anyways. He knows it. He just didn't yeah. study so, it. So what are you doing? Um, I take my uh, my dagger and I uh, cut a little bit on my hand and place my hand on the rune. And okay. utter a on prayer each one? to the gods. On each, uh, on each of the uh, runes? Yes. Okay. Uh, you do. do they, wait. Do they all say blood, though? Yeah, they all say blood. Fair? Okay. All right. You do that on the four runes, and he goes. Oh, uh, where's everyone? All right, so I know Green's right here, or at least on one of these corners. Where's everyone else, by the way? I'm. Mm. I'm gonna stay on my spider bro. Um, on my spider bro. Actually, you know what? I'll I'll, I'll stay him uh, kind of right on the edge there. He's. Uh, it it dips in, right? Oh, it's a vertical. Okay. On the inside. Uh, he'll, he'll, he's kind of right on the middle there, then. All right. So you, so he's on the middle. He's not dipping in. Okay. I, mean, um, I don't see a reason to go down there yet. So I'm just gonna stay on the grass. I'm gonna leave this spider bro right near, uh, right near Green in case anything goes bad. Um, you know. Uh, I think uh, maybe I'll take a step back, considering okay. all the weird magical stuff is yeah. kind of ended good. up pretty dangerous. All right. So you put your hand on each one of these. Put your hand on each one of these runes. That's bleeding. And he goes, vroom, 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 vroom. And you're looking down, and you just see yellow light um, that is going around the walls down below. <clears throat> and then you see runes light up on the floor below. Psh, bright runes. And then in this floor, the walls that have those intricate carvings, this arcane yellow light just... Whips itself around inside those lines. And, Fel, you're noticing, uh, well, Fel and that spider. You're on the edge there. Mm hmm. All of a sudden, you feel this kind of pulse beneath you. And the edge that you're standing on lights up and explodes. I need you to make a DC 18 dexterity saving throw. Wow. And everyone else within 20 feet of the edge to make a DC 14 dexterity saving throw. So that's still me? Yeah. Come on, baby. I think Doug ah! just barely missed it. Nice. Uh, all, right. all right. So, Fell, you will take half. Uh, roll right. one for uh, your spider, too. How far is it down? Oh, spider bros half. Um... You've got. Do, do, do I need to do one? You're. You know, it's your. You're actually. Fu oh. No, at, ooh, Atlas, just the way you're kind of. Yeah, you guys will both need to do one just because it's kind of like a. Yeah. Right. You guys how, will both. How far down is the fall? Uh Oh, uh, you got. You're fine. There will oh. be no fall. Okay. I just cool. need dexterity saving throw. Oh, it's 10. Fells. 
Oh, that was for the spider? Yeah, spider bros. And Atlas He's... is 12. All right. Uh, Fell was the uh, the major one. You and that spider. Um, well, you will take half of this damage. It's force damage, by the way. So half of 37. So uh, ba -ba -ba -ba, 36 is 18, uh, 18 points of damage. So make a DC 18 concentration check, by the way. Yep. Oh, no, no. Sorry, sorry. 10. 10. Because it's half of the damage you take or 10. Uh, right. And whichever's just higher. Your, your spell casting modifier. No, it's All it's right. not wisdom. It's constant. I thought it was constitution. Oh, it's. Uh, it would have been the same number. Okay. Yeah, You're it's right. always it Constitution. Is con it is Constitution. All right, uh, same number, though. The same plus two. That's fine. But you take that, and the spider takes 37 points. Uh, and still. then who took... Oh, that means you died. I mean, that means you fall, right? I I was jumping away, right? No, uh, you fall. Uh, right. Well, I mean, you fall on uh, the inside. So you fall 40 right. feet. Um, oh, that's... <laughs> That falls a little bit too much to really, to really uh, take less from. So 16 points of damage. So make another DC 10 concentration check, and then Atlas and John, I mean, and Anos, will take um, God. this much force damage. 15 force so damage. damage as the edges Damn. kind of fizzle. <laughs> it looks like. This something is odd here, mainly because uh, it looks like a blown circuit might, you know. Uh, it's just kind of, it was supposed to continue on, but something was not completing it. But, uh, Green, you look around, and it's this just huge sound. That's force damage, not bludgeoning, right? Force, yes. Okay, so I take all of it. Yeah. You know what, I have to... Uh... Um, I think I, I think I just have to cast this. Uh, did that? No, it didn't. Didn't take away one. I was wondering if it would. I'll, I'll just keep track of myself. Um. Yeah, no, you lose the one that. that died. But no, no, no. Uh, I was just looking at my character sheet. Okay. If it would automatically get rid of the spells or not, and it doesn't. But that's okay. Um, I, I took care of it. I never actually took that spell away from my okay. uh, sheet. But okay, um, all right. But these there are ruins on the next floor below Green that you can see. It's very odd, but it is about forty feet down to the next room. Hmm. Uh, okay, is there a way to get down there? Or is it just a straight straight drop? Straight drop. God. All I have to do is go back to sleep, and I can get us down there, and then I can, uh, you can hang a rope, right? I mean, we could all just climb down a rope, too. All I've got to do is just sleep. <laughs> Are you curing everyone's wounds? No, oh, fuck no. I'm curing my wounds. Oh. Uh, um, I have no potions anymore. I use them all in that bag. We're not taking a short rest or anything, so I assume that, uh... It's up to you guys if you want to. <laughs> we can't use a hit die, so... Or hit dice. I mean, you don't get anything back from a short short rest, so you can use your hit die. No, I'm talking. About, I'm talking. In to, a short uh, rest, you use, you can use your hit die. Not uh, spell wise or anything. Now, um, yeah. actually, I think I get levitate back. Let me check. But not that it matters because we can all go down a rope anyway. So you don't really need levitate. Levitate was a long rest there. for you. I, I'd have to double check. Um, yeah, double check that. There's a chance it's it's short rest. But well, anyways, what are you guys doing? Um, I mean, contemplating going down this hole. Okay. Well, so also to to my friends on the east coast, uh, what time do you guys need to get going? Too, because like right now it seems well, like a pretty good spot. I was thinking our normal time of nine thirty. I wouldn't go past that. Yeah. Uh, nine thirty your time or my time, which would be exactly one hour from now. Okay, well, I'm not going to be able to do that if I have to be at work for 5.30 tomorrow. So right, We can stop here if you want. Um, I'll say this looks like a pretty good place to stop since we're not in immediate danger. All right. So what are you guys planning to do next time? 
Just to <laughs> give me a heads up, because I got no idea. I would imagine. Yeah, I would imagine going down that that. It will shaft only take another I hour have... and a half, at most, to do this. So what, yeah, what I mean, are you planning on doing next session? This the stack rank order that we kind of had was um, this, right? All right. So tomb, yeah. goblins, sertan, which is not spelled library. right. Uh, library. Well, library as a whole. Yeah, it's, uh, yeah. yeah. That's, that's Act Two essentially. I know, um, but I'm just saying, like that's the I order of things order. that I see. All right. So we've got goblins and and sertans to do, and then also technically ortuk could fit in there where we take ortuk back. All right. Um, to the dryads. Yeah. yeah. Is Matt? Do you see anything else really coming up before you want us to move on to Act Two? No. For that's library, pretty much it. Yeah, so it the southwest region or southeast region, sorry, is that within our territory? Like no, the that's far. That... That's like a thousand or so miles away from your land, as far as you know. They Damn. said far, far to the southeast and lands that have risen again. So it's in the new lands that have just risen a couple months ago. Because it's otherwise it would still be existing as a nation. Yeah. It's like a saying goodbye to everybody for fucking ever kind yeah. of. It's pretty intense. I know it's all game and fake and stuff, but damn, that make me homesick already. Yeah. <laughs> all right, guys. Uh, I guess we'll stop there then. All right. All right, man. All right. So, back to the stream. See you. Have a good night. Thanks for watching.